Look at that. Yay. Come here and get a treat. Come here and get a treat. Good boy. Come on, hang on. Good boy. Hang on, I don't know where the treats are. Good boy. Here, let's give you another one. Yeah. Let's put them in my pocket to make them easier to get. Nope, stay away from that. Stay away from that. Come on. Yeah, the sun's going down on the dog walk. On the puppy dog walk. Maybe we'll see bears, coyotes. Maybe we'll see a rabbit. You'd like to see a rabbit, Sars? One of them lives in our bush. Would you like to chase a rabbit? A little dog, he wants a rabbit. Would you like to chase a rabbit today? I think Aiden has hurt himself going after a rabbit. But puppy's fast. you guys doing? Hmm? Hmm? Come on, get away from me. Whatever you're doing, stop that. Don't lick things. Thank you. Oh, what do you got in your mouth? What are you doing? Come here. It's like something dead. Come here. No. Oh, I'm sorry, it wasn't. My panic. My bad. All right, come on. Come on. Aiden, get out of the road. Come here. Come here. Get out of the road. Come on. Okay, let's do some. Let's do the leash cam. It's like playing a video game, but you're walking dogs. Uh oh. See another German Shepherd puppy. He's a year and a half old. He's half German Shepherd and half Malamor. I think I said that correctly. Spinning these around, where they land, nobody knows. Come on, little maniacs. This house here used to have two very large Great Danes. I don't know what happened to them. It was, has been a few years. Maybe they, you know.
Hey. It's not a library. Let's go. Come on. This little German Shepherd named Sars is the sweetest, smartest little German Shepherd I've ever had. And I've had eight of them. He learns quickly. He snuggles in my neck to go to bed. Bites the hell out of my arm when he wants to play. Bites the hell out of my leg when he wants to play. And he bites Aiden when he wants to play. Can't say he's the most bitey dog I've ever had, but he does bite a lot. Oh, puppy sees that other dog. Come on, Aiden. Should be all right. This isn't Fight Club. This isn't Doggy Fight Club. Let's go. Come on. Aiden, come on. Aiden's not afraid, but he will avoid confrontation. But if confrontation happens to approach us, he'll jump right in there like a dog with foam and mouth fever. <laughs> that was a mad dog joke. <laughs> Alright, come on. And come on. Alright, come on. We'll take the bear trail. I call it the bear trail because a bear cornered us there one time and Aiden won't go down there anymore. He stopped us about 30 feet from the woods. And he refused to move. And then suddenly a bear comes walking out right past us. So really I exaggerate when I say it cornered us. But Aiden knew. Although we have a lot of bears here and none of them attack you. Come on big baby. Let's go to the bear trail. He's not waiting there to ambush us. I think the puppy needs to uh, puppy needs to get the smell of the bear. So far, he thinks that smell in the yard is me, and I haven't bathed. Hey, then, come on, puppy, come on, hey then. Why are you fighting? Let's go this way. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Let's go to the bear. One bear sighting over here. Mostly deer. A crazy guy on a bicycle. I was with Aiden here one time and this guy. Rides up on a bicycle. Oh, see, can you see the deer and her fawn over there? Let's see if we can get closer. Can you see her looking at us? Little baby fawn. Um, I don't want to disturb her, even though I already have. Come on, Aiden. And there she goes. And there goes her little baby. Look at Sarge watching him run away. 
Well, we're not gonna go down there because we don't want to disturb the mama and her baby. Not because of you, Aiden. I'll zoom in on this when I edit it. Come on, let her go back in the yard with the good grass. Come on. All right, Aiden. We're going to come up here and stop. Or we're going to get a treat. Who wants a treat? Treat? Anyone? Aiden, we're not going home that way. Come on. Okay, come here. Who wants a treat? Oh, I know you want one. Sit. Sit. Good boy. Aiden, come here. Aiden doesn't sit anymore because his joints hurt him. Aiden, you want a treat? Come here, Aiden. Just want to go home? Your joints hurt? Okay, I get it. Can you see the mama deer? With her baby out there waiting for us to leave so they can bed down for the night in the bushes behind someone's backyard yeah there she goes she's starting to walk back there sorry my dog tried to tell me not to go down there and bother you One night I couldn't sleep and I looked out in the front yard and there was a deer giving birth and it looks like she was struggling. So I went out and I was walking toward her. I was going to help her and I was going to pull the baby out and blood was everywhere. And I said, all right, it's all right, mama. I'm going to help you. And just as I got close to put my hand on her, she took off running and there's a big giant black bear standing in this place. I thought, this is a trap. They are working together to kill me. I'd gone from holding a baby deer, screaming to my daughter to take a picture, to screaming, call 911, because a bear mauled me to death. And he was very persistent, too. He wouldn't walk away like they normally do. He wanted that, he wanted that unborn baby. Well, anyways, after staring at each other for a while, and usually can stare the bears down, he refused to budge, I refused to budge. Finally, he just took a wide path around me and walked out to where the deer ran. One might say, well, why didn't you just walk away and leave the bear? Because I don't want to turn my back on a carnivore because only food runs away or food shows their back to the big bears and wolves coyotes panthers panthers and you don't want to look like food of course with my fat belly I'm sure that would have been more desirable to a polar bear we don't have polar bears here. I don't think. Come here, Sarge. Come here, treat. Come here, sit. Sit. Good boy. Okay, let's roll.
Come on, we're not going over there. Why are you going over there? Don't teach the puppy bad habits. Come on, what you doing, little man? Smelling the Confederate jasmine? Alright, come on, boy. Come on, Bambino. <laughs> I try to record him when he has the zoomies, but by the time I get to my camera, he stops. Come on. Come on. Not going for a ride. We're gonna check the mail. Go in the house. What? Oh, he saw something. If you're wondering, I have this sign in my yard because I had my house cleaned, my roof cleaned, and he uh, asked to leave it there. I let him do such a good job. Hey. <laughs> oh, look at you. You got yourself all tangled. Just like a little puppy. Now I'm going to have to treat you like your little baby. And we're home.